Hey everyone, welcome back to Dope Yoga. My name is Maria. I am an American yoga teacher and expat living in Paris, France. And this channel is all about yoga, it's all about well-being, it's all about feeling good with your body, and um, discovering life in France as an expat. Uh, so if you are interested in any of those things, please hit the subscribe button if you like what you see, and I will share back the love. Um, I also have my cat Alaska, who's the star of the channel here, so you'll see him roaming around um, <laughs> frequently. Uh, today's practice is going to be a feel-good, uh, very quick flow, uh, 10 minutes, where we really move, we really wake up the body, and we really kind of ground ourselves. It's going to be all about detoxification as well, and just a quick fix to make you feel really good and to seize your day. So it's really if you if you have got to go out the door, if you don't have enough time, this is the perfect practice for you. You can also include this practice um, before or post workouts so that you kind of like really get the benefits of it. So let's go ahead and get started. We're going to sit in a started uh, in a seated position today, and we're just going to. Massage a little bit our thighs, rolling our head from one side and then the other, kind of waking up the body, and going ahead and making circles with all of our body now. So really just like activating our spine, um, making sure to wake up all of those muscles, and let's reverse the circle. And as I said, this is a quick practice. We're going to go quite a quickly through all the postures, but I promise it's going to give you lots of benefits. Beautiful. Now we're going to windshield wipe our feet. So all we're doing is we're bringing the knees from one side to the other, just kind of to let go of any tension we've had. Voila, just to make sure that those are nice and warmed up. And we're gonna go ahead and take a tabletop position. We wanna work really quickly. Um, I wanna work on every single part of your body. So your abs, your, uh, your arms, your booty, so the first exercise we're going to do is we're going to do a half uh, tabletop plank. So what we're doing is we're going to inhale, bring our left leg high, and then extending the opposite arm. And we're just going to do a kick and a crunch. So kick, crunch, kick, crunch. Good job, keep going. Kick, crunch, kick, crunch, one more. Kick, crunch. Very nice. And now we're just going to do baby pulses with that, with that supported leg and arm. Just to kind of fire up those abs today. Breathe. Breathing is your friend. We're almost there. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Very good. Good job. Bring that other arm on the floor. Go ahead and tuck the knee. And all we're doing is we're just going to hover for five breaths in this posture. One, two, three, four, five. Go ahead and extend into your three-legged dog. You should feel a really nice stretch here in your hip flexor and your psoas. Go ahead and bend that top knee and step it in between your hands. Really nice. Let's go ahead and sway back and forth here. Feeling that nice opening. And what we're going to do is we're going to do a twisted high lunge. So keeping your left hand on the floor, extending your right. Just feeling that nice stretch. This is really, really nice to do in the morning, especially. Even if you're gonna be sitting all day, this is a really, really good stretch to get into those hamstrings, to get into those psoas muscles. Beautiful, inhale, put that knee down, and we're gonna go into pyramid. So we're, all we're doing is extending both of our legs. And what I want you to do to go even deeper is I want you to flex that top leg. Inhale, go up, exhale, go down. So what we're trying to do is really trying to get our belly and our chest on top of that knee. And breathe here. Mm. Just feel it out. It's really nice to go into everything. 
Inhale, let's bend that leg. And exhale, go into our high lunge. Opening up everything. Mm. Beautiful. Carve with your arms, warrior two. So all we're doing here is we're making sure that our belly is tucked in, that our um, knees over top of our ankle, and we're just relaxing here, grounding yourself. Inhale, let's go ahead and do the peaceful warrior. So my um, back arm is trying to touch my thigh if possible, and I'm really opening up my thoracic region. Breathe, enjoy. Back into a warrior two. Inhale, open up that knee. Put all the way back into the back hips. Triangle pose. So let me actually face you, that would be better, huh? All we want to do is we want to put our um, right arm this time on the floor and we're stacking up our shoulders so our left arm is stacked up and pointing towards the sky. Breathe. Feel how good that position should feel. Beautiful. Inhale. Let's go back into our warrior two. Exhale. We're going to extend that right leg. Let's go ahead and pigeon toe it into our wide legged stance. We're going to heel toe just a little bit. Put our hands on our hips. Go ahead and go forward. Wide legged stance. Right now we're just going to feel it out, bring our hands on the floor. If you're advanced, you can take uh, your, um, your inversion here. So I'm going to go ahead and take one, just to show you guys what's possible in this posture. So all we're doing is we're going up on our head and we're taking Inverting here. Feel it out, engage your abs. And go ahead and come back down. For those of you who didn't do that, just stay in your head to toe fold. Beautiful. Inhale, bring your hands up. Go up. I'm going to do everything on the other side. So we're going to go. To the warrior two, this time your left leg is bent. Feel it out here, ground yourself. Peaceful warrior, so that right arm is behind you and you're really reaching out towards you. Opening up that area of your body. Beautiful, go back into your warrior two. Inhale, we're going to go into our trikonasana. So we're going to extend that left leg. We're gonna put all of our weight into the back part of our hips, bringing the left arm down and the right arm up, stacking the shoulders, trikonasana. Breathe. Strings. Beautiful. Let's turn towards the front of the room. Inhale. We're going to turn the other leg and we're going to go and start with our pyramid posture here. So all we're doing, as we did on the other side, is we're trying to really make sure to bring our head towards the knee here. And making sure our you know, chest falls over, squaring off our hips. Breathe. With each posture in yoga, we're oxygenating our bodies. This should feel really good in terms of oxygenation. Beautiful. Inhale. Let's bend that right knee. And go up into our high lunge on the left side. 
You're doing really good. This is a really quick practice, so for those of you who are busy, like me, I love to do this in the morning, and this really gets me going. Inhale. Beautiful, let's go ahead and take a twisted high lunge, so your right arm is gonna go down, your left arm is gonna go up. Feel the body here, feel how nice it feels. Opening everything up. Beautiful, let's go back into our supported high lunge. Three-legged dog on this side, so this time your left leg goes up high. And then flexing your foot, downward facing dog. So we did everything basically on both sides, but we inverted the the sequence so that we, you know, made sure we did everything on both ends. Inhale, vertebrae by vertebrae, let's go up into our plank. Now what I want you to do is we're going to go into chaturanga, but we're going to hold it for two breaths. So exhale, chaturanga, hold. One, two, three. Beautiful upward facing dog. And go back into your down, uh, child's pose, excuse me. Just stay here for a little bit. Wonderful, and vertebrae by vertebrae, we're just gonna come up onto our knees. Kind of doing a nice shoulder roll. Inhale, bringing your hands up all the way towards the sky. And hands to the heart. And there you have it. So it's a super quick and effective practice that you can do in the morning if you're short on time. Um, it's, um, it's really great I do it, so I attest to it. Um, if you liked this class, so it's like a quick power um, fixer-upper, make sure to subscribe. I have lots of really cool um, classes that are longer, lots of meditations, and as I said, life in France. And I'm really, really happy to see you next time. Thank you, guys. Namaste.